Hey folks, I just wanted to show you a little trick for repairing your refrigerator. We have a Whirlpool refrigerator. Let's see if this works. There is the model and serial number of the refrigerator and I'll just scan across the tag. This is inside the door on the left hand side. What happens with our refrigerator is there's a drain up top from the freezer and sometimes that gets clogged and water starts to come down here so we have to put something to catch all that water. So what I do is I end up coming and I've already loosened the screws but what I do because of that leak is I loosen two screws on the bottom here I take this pan out on the bottom and then I loosen two screws in the back and this piece comes off there's a little clip over here, which you got to remember to put back on. This clip should be attached to this piece of metal here. That's a, that's a ground. So before you put this back together, make sure you put that back on. But once you get to the, the inside of the refrigerator, in the back, this is where the cold air goes down to the refrigerator and right below your cooling elements there's a drain right back here and I don't know why but I guess some food gets caught in there once in a while and we get this big chunk of ice which then flows over here and clogs up this drain hole and all the water starts dripping down to the refrigerator so for the third time in the last year I was up tonight cleaning this out it's about 11:30 at night and I've discovered a trick to help out what I did is I just took uh, I just took a, a mug and, and heated the hot water in um, the microwave and then I just took the old turkey baster, sucked the water out and shot it right down that hole. I had already just been dumping water on top of it but I think from here on out when this happens I'll just you know get some uh, nuke that water for about a minute or so make it nice and hot and then just use the turkey baster to shoot it down. Once the water cools off, pick it up and then just keep doing it. And within like two pumps of the turkey baster, all that water just flowed right down and I could hear it dripping out. There's a pan down below that catches it. But I just wanted to show you that little tip or trick because, uh, you know, I suspect I'll be doing this again and um, maybe you will too, so that can help you out.